Uh, well, of course they didn't, and we're still seeing just how good a player he is now. Is Benzema the best player in the world at the moment? Player, mm, difficult one. Um, best cent- striker, is he be- S- centre forward. He's Lewandowski. Um, so I, I would go probably Lewandowski, but Benzema at the minute, what he's doing in the Champions League is obviously getting a lot of the coverage. But ben, uh, Le- Lewandowski's been fantastic. So you'd probably say on form, probably one of them too would be great. Oh, we know Haaland, you got the Kane question, but right now on form, you'd have to go Benzema. Mm. He's playing wow. I'm not seeing anything like it. What, what was better, his penalty or his, go- or his other goal last night? I love the penalty, the, the audacity to do that in that type of situation where they need that goal for him to that's, do that's that. That's frightening, wasn't it? Frightening. I still don't think you'll beat the two headers against Chelsea. No. They were... What was the better one? I, I think the second one was better. See, it, yeah, because he obviously he had he generated no power, just direction. Yeah. But I do like the first one. The first one, one was phenomenal. Rocky. Yeah, they were both cool. incredible, right? Yeah. But he's an incredible footballer right now. And mm. I think Thierry Henry's got a point. I think with Giroud up front, he had done well. I, I was never really a massive Giroud fan at Arsenal if I'm honest but you do need a different type of, type of striker as well at that time and Benzema probably would have been perfect as well because he was playing really well because if that was 2016-17 mm. I mean he had a what was it he had a, a bit of a, a lean spell where he scored 11 one season but the season before 15 and 16 league he scored 24 and 27 games so you were getting a prolific Benzema mm. at that time but you know what Arsenal are like do you, oh what do you mean by that you know, they just won't pay <laughs> is that what you mean they do pay right Pepe was like 70 million honestly that there is just the, is one of the world's Many mysteries. <laughs> 72 million. <laughs> but... That is nuts, isn't it? Nuts. And they thought they were getting get a good deal because they were paying it over, what, three or four installments? No. 72 for Pepe. <laughs> Honestly. Isn't that crazy? I know. What's worse, do you think? 72 for Pepe, 80 or, million or, for Maguire. Or Lukaku for 97. Or, or Maguire for 80. Or, or Lukaku for 97. Probably Maguire's probably been the worst. Fan no, I wouldn't say... Pepe, what, 72 yeah. for Pepe? <laughs> no, no, That's no. the worst, isn't it? It's, it's terrible. It's yeah, terrible. it is bizarre. Oh, we're getting a bargain. We're only paying eighteen million pounds. Do you think Benzema is the best in the world right now? Um, Player wise, is hard. Striker is an argument. Yes, probably. Yeah, he is. I, I'm seeing more of him than I am Lewandowski at the moment for obvious reasons. Champions League, and you yeah. don't watch that much La Liga. Um, La, Liga. La, Levendo- La, La Liga. Liga. What did I say? La Liga for Lewandowski. No, I said I said you don't you don't watch much Benzema. Oh, I see. Right, but, um, but Lewandowski, you don't watch much Bundesliga. No, I don't watch much Bundesliga. Do you? Not really. I see highlight clips or YouTube stuff, but I don't watch 90 minute but games. But Lewandowski, I think if, if Bayern was still in, obviously in the Champions League, you'd be seeing a lot more Lewandowski because yeah. he is I just think top ben, draw. Ben, Benzema, when a player does, the, you know, the... Well, the headers were fantastic, right? But when he steps up and takes a penalty like that, in such an important moment of such an important cup tie, I just think you've got something a little bit special that other players wouldn't even dream of doing. And that tells you so much about the player. Can you imagine if you missed it, though? I know, but he, but I think if a player's going to do that, he's never going to miss it. I said Aguero do the same thing and, and someone no, catch Agu- it. No, 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 Aguero's was awful. Gary Lineker, I don't know if you remember this. Gary yeah, for, Lineker, for the record. It, what, for the joint record yeah, yeah, of Sir Bobby yeah. Charlton, yeah. But I just think if you've got the kahunas to say, can I say if you've got the balls to do that? Maybe I can, I don't know. But either way, if you if you can do that. What's worse, trying to do Penenka and it getting saved? Or what Bruno tried to do, that whole start or stop what? and roll oh, it. Oh, Jorginho, why are you just... Why? Yeah, but I was going to get to Jorginho. Jorginho's was worse. I, I was about to get to Jorginho. What was worse? But he jumped on top what of me. What was worse? Probably yours, Bruno's. No, of course it wasn't. He missed, a tar- he missed a target. No, but he would have scored. But he missed it, the target. It, it, it went past the post. Even though Jorginho's was really soft. No, no, there's no. A, there's still a, a, more no. Of a tra- no. I, I, I get, Let, let's bring in Walter Peaton here. Maybe he can tell us which one was worse because I have to say... Bruno missed the target. So there's, doesn't there's, matter. He's penalty just no, grazed no, no, the no, post. No, 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 Jorginho's no, 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 was like a pass back. Listen, a listen, pass back. Listen, let's bring in Walter Peaton. No, no, no. Yeah, Walter, no, don't, Walter, don't come no, in let's bring Walter, in Walter, No, wait, listen. Go on. At no point ever was Bruno's ever going in because it missed the target. Jorginho's was terrible, but the keeper could have slipped. Right, it was awful. It was, let's bring Jorginho's Walter was better than... Walter, what did you make? Whose penalty was worse? Well, you, you have to look at the laws of, the, of it all, and you have to say that um, Bruno's was worse. He didn't hit the target. It's not got no chance, not got no chance, never of never going not in. So you've got to say <laughs> that, um, that Bruno's was worse. OK, well, there you go, the views of Walter Pete. Yeah. I can't argue with Walter, obviously, but... I see what you're saying. It was on target. But Jorginho's was embarrassing. Yeah, it was embarrassing, but at least it was a target. Okay. Who cares? I don't know why I asked you. Walter <laughs> Peter. Let's quickly go to the phone line, shall we? 0371722334. Anthony's a Man City fan. He joins us now. Anthony, how are you? Hi, uh, mate. You all right? Yeah, I'm good. Very well. How are you? Yeah, not too bad. How are you? How are you, boss? You all right? Yeah, I'm all good, mate. Go listen, great show, lads. Thanks, mate. Go on, you've got about a minute. Off you go, Ant. Is that it? Right, listen, do you remember a couple of weeks ago when I said about the Liverpool Man City games and I said I was going I was a bit nervous about the FA Cup. Mm. I had a feeling I, I had a feeling I was you know, I had a, 
I knew I had a feeling that I was going to be nervous for that game. Right. Anyway, I just wanted to get that off the chest because I remember it, mentioning it to you. Um, yeah, last night, game. Crap, game and a half, that, weren't it? Yeah. Uh, yeah, so... <laughs> and are you nervous? <laughs> Don't be nervous, no, Ant. Don't be nervous. No, no, no. Listen, okay. it's because you said you've got about a minute, so I'm just... Oh, I apologise. I apologise. I didn't mean to put you under pressure. Go on, you say whatever you like, Ant. Uh, so you're on about, uh, obviously, the, the best player of, in City... I'm going to go put it out there and put it silver. That's the, you know what, that's not putting it out there because a lot, I think a lot of people, Manchester City fans would say... Um, not, I, there's I, no I, right or wrong answer. I remember seeing uh, Fabian Delph and I said to him about, oh my God, De Bruyne, like, what a player. And I remember him kind of interrupting me and saying, no, it's about David Silva. Do you know what I mean? So you got players in the dressing room at that time. Let me ask you, if we ask that question in five years' time, will everyone say Phil Foden? I don't know. Oh, you're not convinced about Phil Yeah, if he, if he carries on the same trajectory, then yeah, of course he's got an opportunity. That's a big old word for you. Where'd you get that from? <laughs> Five years a You've long time. You've been Jeremy Carl, haven't you? Just down there, yeah, talk TV. <laughs> he's fantastic, though, isn't he? With Jeremy Carl? <laughs> no. Um, Phil, <laughs> no. Phil Foden's incredible. Yeah, he's incredible. He's incredible. For such a young he's age. He's going to get better and better. And how ironic that the Champions League final was on his birthday. Do you, know, do you know what I like about that whole scenario as well? Is that a lot of people try to question Pep about why is he not letting him go out on loan? Yeah. Why is he not letting him do this? Yeah. And he just guided him in the right way. And now 100%. Look at him. 100%. I agree. 